this massive branch came down from this huge large tree. You can see right up there. It was from the split, split leader of this larch. So that branch came up over here and the wind must have twisted it and brought it down. It's always sad when that happens. And what's even more sad is it's beginning to flower. The beautiful larch flowers. You can see. So it's flowering down here on its last life. Its last days of life. They're beautiful. The larch um, flowers are just gorgeous and they're so beautiful. They're so tiny. You can see how tiny they are. Most people don't even know they flower or exist. But if you look at the tree itself, it's still on the tree. The flowers aren't blooming yet. They're still in bud form. So out of desperation, the branch that knows it's no longer connected to the main tree has started to bloom its flowers. They're so beautiful. Some of them are still in bud. Not coming out yet. And they might not make it because there might not be enough strength in them to come out. So the death of a branch of part of a tree and how it tries to resist and continue on for the next generation. The blooms, it hopes somebody will pollinate and can turn into the cones. Here's cones from last year so that it can seed. These cones won't have seeds in them. They'll have already been eaten by birds and things like that. There won't be any seeds in these. But that's last year's seed head or cone. So you can see that's the flower and that's the seed head of the larch.